everybody, welcome to the Flying Galleons here at Maury's Piers. Real close to closing times, 4 11 o'clock here. And we would check this out. It's very unique. Hey, we're about to drop off. A little bit of an incline here. We'll go over part of the water park where we were at earlier. I love that water park so much. Yeah, it is so unique. They still got the sky pod slides going. Up there were so nice. Oh, yeah. Welcome back. Everybody here is so friendly. The lifeguards, the employees, they're very helpful. Yeah. I mean, it's a really cool how could you possibly hit your job if you were here? <laughs> oh. Check out that. Look at all the tubes down there. Woo! the other side over here. I guess that's the Seagull Railway there. That's closed today. It's like a cycling type ride, I think. On that orange track next door. Right over one of the other sky pods here. We went on that like seven times today, didn't we? There. That was awesome. Yeah. yeah, that's how close we are. Damn. Whew. So much of this park interacts with each other. Oh yeah, that's, that's why that's why I love these beach side parks. We got a crane here, they get so close together. And the deer where they, they interact and ride and touch each other. There's a good view of the Surfside Pier across the way over there. You can see the uh, famous Nor'easter. That was part of the uh, newer coast of the uh, runaway tram. I think that opened up last year, 2019. There's Nanny. Hey. Frizzy hair. Yeah, my hair is like super <laughs> hot mess. Don't mind me. <laughs> good view of the uh, half moon up there as well. Coming up on the kids area of the water park. Oh yeah, we, we have to go over there, yeah, the bucket. Sure, right, we'll just come back. <laughs> okay. I'm perfectly okay with coming back here, even though it's like yeah. 750 miles away. A couple cute little slides in there, tipping bucket. Very well themed as well with the pirate ships and stuff. Pretty cool, kind of takes you around the whole back half of the pier. Totally worth the drive out here. Totally worth oh, it. Oh, yeah. It takes about three and a half, four hours to get here from Hershey. Yeah, from Hershey, yeah. Pennsylvania. If your GPS tells you it'll be three hours and 15 minutes, it is lying. <laughs> yeah, we still made it here really quickly. We did. Totally worth it. This place is beautiful and has a lot to offer. Beach now, yep. Overhanging the side of the pier. And you can see part of the lazy river, all the tubes down there. All put up for the night. Sky coaster at the pier over there, and of course the great white wooden coaster, which is 
closed right now. This park has so many unique rides. Oh yeah. This is definitely a hidden gem. Like if you're looking for something interesting to do that rivals anything else yet that you've done from here. Check it out. It's got an amazing white package on it too. It really does. I love Ferris wheels. I actually used to be terrified of them until I went on the giant wheel at Cedar Point. And now I'm like yeah. fascinated with their light shows. Uh, we're gonna swing back around here over the uh, or the midway again. We got four of six coaster completion here. Or well, actually four for seven if you count the uh, great white. Boomerang was open earlier, but uh, it is not now. So we should have rode it earlier. And then the uh, wild mouse went down over on the other side. So we'll come back and we'll knock those credits off at some point. As well as everything else. A couple of dark rides here too. There's one there in the pirate ship. And there's one on the other two as well. Ferris wheel is so beautiful, I can't stop looking at it. Oh, yeah, look at that. Right up next to the end. Enjoy the rest of your stay. I could probably touch this one. Yeah, you probably could. I totally just touched yeah. <laughs> it. That's it, everything. Crammed in here, they gotta make room. Yeah, we were going up the left hill on uh, what's the LLC ride that I like? Uh, Great Nor'easter. Great Nor'easter. I was able to touch the steps oh, yeah. as we were going up the left hill. There's the cycling ride there, the little carts for the seagull cycle. Now we're gonna head back into the uh, pirate ship looking structure here. We'll uh, disembark. Things starting to quiet down a little bit. So you close them down for the night. Right after today, it puts me a coaster credit 440. So it puts me 60 away from that 500 goal. So not too bad. Headed up to Great Adventure tomorrow. Hey. So I got most of my credits there except for one, and then Six Flags America to be a new park for so You guys have never been to Great Adventure. Nope. Nobody's been to, Great, to uh, America yet. I've actually never yeah. been this far east on a road trip. Oh, yeah. About as far east as you can go. Woo! Alright, we're back. Woo!